YouTube, what is going down? It is your boy Matt Merced. Thank you guys for coming back to another video today. What I'm here with today is part three of my EA Sports Fight Night Champion Road to the Go 2 series starring Matt Merced. Uh, first things first, man, I appreciate you guys coming back. As promised in the last episode, we didn't really like how the smooth boxing style was, so we're going to switch it up here. If you guys haven't seen part one and two, I already uploaded it. The links will be down below in the description, so check those out and see where we're up to. Uh, like I just said before, though, we're making our professional debut here, so stay tuned, man. Thank you guys for watching the video. Um, I think for the style, we're going to go with speed here. We're going to give this a shot. This is the old school Roy Jones Jr., and we're going to see how this one goes. This should be pretty dope. I'm pretty excited for this. Um, yeah, man, pro boxing debut. Never been so sweet. We're back, man. We're back. We're back. We're back with another video. And this one should be good, man. I'm going to look to knock our opponent out here. This is our first professional fight. Um, let's schedule a fight here. All right, so we can choose anywhere from the 43rd rank all the way up to the 50th rank. So since we're going to try to, like, move up in the ranks quickly, let's try to challenge this 43rd rank, Larry Jennings. Uh, February 16, 2011, six-round fight. We can make a total of almost 4K here. All right, guys, it looks like in this screen here, we're going to be able to pick which location we want to train out of. Uh, choosing a location for training camp is important for your boxer's development. Each camp will affect the growth of your athleticism differently and have different set of training games to build your skills. Concentrate on skills training and experiment with different camps to get the most out of your training. Matt Merced's ready, man. He didn't come here to play any games. Um, I think we can only pick the home gym for now. Everything else is too expensive for us. We'll be able to buy those later as we make more money with these fights. So let's book the training camp for the home gym. It's going to simulate the fights for us. Okay, now that we schedule our first fight, it's time to train. Training isn't all about hitting the gym, though. You will need to keep a constant eye on your current stamina and manage your time between training skills and athleticism, improving popularity through promo events and taking part in sparring events. Each action takes its toll on stamina, so be sure to rest the week leading up to your fight so that you will have a full tank of gas. All right, guys, pretty cool here. Um, let's train for this first week here. We can either do skills training or athletic training. Okay, so athletic training is non-interactive program. Skills training is interactive program. Let's go with some skill training here. We can do open sparring, stay on your feet, the double end bag, and heavy bag combos. For our first thing, let's do a little open sparring here. Yeah, and let's get right into this, guys. We have to get a total, I think, of our four champion is 40,000 points. Alright man, we're going to get right into this right now. Let's see if we can uh, do good in sparring. Maybe, you know, give a little preview of what's to come in the boxing debut. Woo! I'm excited guys. Thanks for coming back. Hit that subscribe button here if you're new for all future content. Uh, okay, so far I'm, I'm liking the fighting stance. And we're gaining points by our opponent missing. We got to get 40,000 guys. We got two minutes. If we miss strikes or get hit, we're going to lose points. Like, as you can see on screen, we're losing a lot of points here. It's all good. We're going to get used to this. I just weaved into an uppercut. All right, uppercuts look like they land a lot of points. All right, there's a nice shot. I think as we string together combos, we'll get more points. Yeah, we gained like 1,200 there. There's a nice weave right there, catching him with a nice two. Doing what doing. All right, I think we're doing okay, man. All right, we got a minute left. We just got caught with a blistering body shot. We're losing a lot of points right now. Sparring partner's a little overpowered here. He's got crazy speed. All right, we're trying to go for that champion. We need about 20,000 more points in 40 seconds. We went to go weave there, but we're not really catching it the right way. All right, guys, we're going to get used to this. This is our first, like, training session, so we can only learn from here. We 
He's just breaking through our block. Nice weave there, but he blocked it. You can't last here. You won't last in the ring. He's, he's right, though. We're getting caught, guys. It's sparring, dude. Nice work, kid. I don't think we did too good. Yeah, not bad. We got contender. 27,000 points. All right, let's move on here. Okay, so what do we got next? How do we know when we're supposed to train? Okay, there's our stamina. Okay, so we're going to want to make sure that by the time we fight, which is going to be February 2nd, that we have enough stamina to move on here. So we're going to train one more week and then rest the last two. And then we'll fight our next fight. Let's do some double end bag here. Yeah, let's go with this. This should be pretty cool. Alright, so Legacy Mode straight away is different from UFC 3. As they have uh, a lot of interactive s skills training. Alright, so this is going to be cool. We're going to have to move to the side over here. And then work the bag here. Okay, so this is going to get our footwork up. we got to watch out for the bottom over here. Right, I got to get used to this. Once I get my footwork up, we'll have an easier time doing this. All right, here we go. Here's the bonus. Double bonus here. Punch, punch, move. All right, not bad. We're at 10,000 points. I, I didn't see what the target was. Pick it up, pick it up. We still have 30 seconds, so we're probably definitely going to beat this. Let's just pick stay patient. Not drain ourselves too much. Throw in a lot of nice shots. Let's throw the hooks here. Four times pick bonus. It up, pick it up. Yeah, we definitely... I think we definitely did what we're supposed to do here. Yeah, we almost got... Let me, let's try to get 30,000. Eight times bonus. We got four seconds. Can we get some in? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 41,000. Oh, champion is 55. All right, so once, once again, this is our first training session. We're able to boost our speed up there. So we're going to just get better as we move on in this career here. All right, let's rest. We're going to get 80% stamina. We got one more fight week, so let's rest again so we can get 100%. And here we go, guys. Matt Merced's debut. Road to the GOAT 2. Uh, this is it, man. This is the moment Matt Merced's been waiting for. This is his pro boxing debut. Ready to take on a new chapter in his legacy. So here we go, guys. Stay tuned, man. Hit that subscribe button if you guys are new. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you guys are enjoying the series, man. I'm having fun with it so far. We only did two episodes, but... All right, man. 19 years old, 6'3", 250 pounds with an 83-inch reach. There he is, ladies and gentlemen. Looking to become the greatest boxer of all time. He's got a long road ahead of him. He knows he's got a lot of obstacles in his way. He's got a lot of locked doors. This is his first challenge right here. This is the first door that he has to break down. Larry Jennings, 6'1", 255 pounds, fighting out of London, England. With 10 wins and 4 losses. So he's been here before. He's got a little bit more experience than us. Touch him up and let's go. All right, guys. Let's make the debut a pretty good one here, guys. Stay tuned, man. See if we can get a knockout in our first fight ever. All right, let's get it in. We're going to stay on the outside here. Try to establish that jab. Oh, he's got good foot movement. He's clinching already. Look at him. All right, he's moving his head like crazy. Nice shots there by Matt Merced. Double jab. Another double jab on the outside. Creating his distance. He's staying on the outside. Oh, he misses a straight punch. Nice hooks. All right, we caught him with a blistering left hook there. There's another one. Another hook. Oh, powerful left hook lands for both opponents. Oh, he's got his hands down. We're draining his health, man. Let's see if we can get a first round knockout. We got a little bit of power here. There's another shot. Nice little combos here. Oh, we dropped him, guys. 
Look at the uppercut left hook combination. Caught him with a devastating left hook. Can we get a knockout in our debut? We'll see if he gets up. I think he's definitely going to get up, man. Oh, he's, he's pissed now. Yeah, he's ready to fight. All right, let's go, guys. See if we can get a first-round stoppage. Oh, caught him with a nice right hook there. Mixing up combos. He's staying on the inside. He's hurt, though. You can tell he's hurt. He's not really throwing. He's just trying to move his head. Look, he's clinching. Nice block by Matt Merced, man. Good uppercuts. Weaving some shots there. Oh, there we go. All right, now he's throwing. Our opponent's landing, too. But we're definitely doing a lot better. We got the knockdown. Ooh, caught him with a nice three-piece there. See if we can mix up some more combos. Another uppercut lands. Left uppercut's landing clean. Powerful right uppercut, with it, followed by left. Oh, Matt Merced's making these uppercuts be known. We got four seconds. All right, great first round. Great first round of our career, man. Yeah, they're tending to him a little too late. What about in the gym? What about in training camp where you got to teach a guy, move your head, don't get caught so you won't look that way? Maybe they didn't do their job. Come on, breathe deeply. Inhale. Get some air in your lungs, all right? You're fighting his game plan. Box. All right, guys, round two. Here we go. He did good in the first round. We knocked him. We knocked him down. I seen his health was low. I was trying to, was trying to like stay on the inside and really attack him with some good shots. This guy's got some pretty good head movement. There's nothing we can't handle. There's a five punch combination coming through clean. This guy's, this guy's no footwork, man. He's cemented. Look at him, dude. He's just standing. He's not even moving his feet. He's standing in one spot. Just trying to move his head. It's not working in his favor. Let's, let's try to knock this guy out cold here. Devastating left hook lands. All right, he does a good shot to the body there. Following back with some shots, though. I'm trying to counter punch, but he's just not throwing. All right, man, we're catching him now. All right, man, he's just... He's not even throwing. Let's try to throw that jab. He's literally... I don't even think he's throwing more than five punches this entire round. Nice left hook coming through. We're getting his health low. We catch him with one more shot, we might drop him soon. We missed the powerful haymaker. Well, right now, he has to grab. He can't use his legs. You can't counter punch if somebody's not throwing. There's his right hook pushed off. Oh, he weaves that one. Oh, we weave one right back, though. Caught him with a crazy left hook. Oh, another left hook lands clean on the chin. We're doing a good job, guys. There he goes. Now he's starting to throw. Yeah, he knows not to throw, because once he starts throwing is when we catch him with good shots, man. All right, guys. Round three here. Yeah, you, you, heard, you heard the announcer. He's, he's literally not throwing. There's a left hook. What do you mean he doesn't want to throw you think it to yourself? He's a fighter. He's in the ring. He knows that he has a All right, now he's throwing. But if he throws punches, he All right, let's try to, to counter here. Get the head movement. That means he has to take more chances. And some guys would There's a nice straight punch. Caught him with another one, too. Right Accurate shot. Straight right hand comes in. A little head hunting with the left. Throwing some good shots here. Ooh, there's an uppercut. Followed by a weave. Let's wait for him to throw too. There's a left hook. It's boring just sitting there like this guy is. Oh, we caught him with a nice shot. Let's drop him. There we go. Oh, three piece on his way down, guys. Three crazy hooks on the way down here. Followed by an elbow. Look at those shots, guys.
Wow, devastating right hook on his way down, guys. Let's see if he gets up. He might be done. He might be done. Oh, he's up again, dude. All right, let's knock him out now, guys. But Teddy, it's what's ahead that's the problem. Yeah, we're getting a peak right now. Oh, there's a three-piece landing in. He's going to be hurt. A couple more shots, guys. That's all it's going to take. There it is. Let's, let's land an uppercut. Oh, caught him with a hook instead. Uppercut on the way down. Look at Matt Merced with the power on display. Three knockdowns in the first two rounds of his pro debut. Ooh, the uppercut lands, man. He's coming out strong here. This might do it, folks. That might be it. That might be the fight. It's over, guys. Stops the fight. Jennings is not going to hear from those judges. He's a knockout victim. That's it, baby. One fight, one knockout, man. Our road to becoming the greatest of all time has just started. If you guys are new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'm going to end the episode here. This will be episode three of my Road to the Go 2 series, Matt Merced's pro debut. Thank you, thank you guys for staying tuned. We just unlocked Mike Tyson's Terry Cloth for our first knockout, so that's pretty cool. Maybe we might have to equip that for our next fight, but as you can see from here right on the screen, we landed 62% of our strikes. We were very efficient with the jab and the straight. Um, we were overall very efficient, counter-punching. This guy really didn't throw too much. He threw 57 versus 177 while landing, so very different in the amount of strikes thrown. Good fight by us, man. We knocked him down three times. We just moved up. 1-0, man. One knockout. We got a 100% win con uh, percentage, 100% knockout percentage, and a 61% K uh, connect neck percentage. We are now 44th on the ranks for heavyweights. So that's it, man. First fight's done. Thank you guys for watching the video. I appreciate it. Uh, click the links down below to check out all the rest of my content that I have linked down there. If you want to see any of my other videos, you can click the playlist section. And it'll bring you to all the videos that I have uploaded, man. Thank you guys for staying tuned. Thanks for watching the video. It's your boy Matt Merced, man. You already know what time it is. I'm out. Peace.